Pois, pessoal, estamos aqui de volta. Desta vez vamos fazer a story quest do Kamisata Ayato. O personagem que acabou de sair. E depois disto irei tomar a minha decisão sobre... Querer dar rol para ele ou não. Em princípio, eu vou dar rolls para sempre para ele. Mas que já de conhecer mais sobre o personagem diretamente. Antes de... Dar o trigger para a decisão final. No caso, a missão começa aqui em Nazuma. Passamos pelas streets aqui. E começa já de... Opa! Cutscene. Quando já começa com uma cutscene, quer dizer que... Capricharam. Ou oh, pergunta quem são eles. Yep. Back when we first arrived in Inazuma, we escorted Hiragi Chisato out of Rito with him. Remember? That's how we got out. Next to him is Ife, Kujo Kamaji's servant. That day when we hung out with A, he came and told us that Kujo Kamaji had gone missing. He was really worried. I was sincere. Não sei quem são. Deixamos aumentar o som do, do Genshin. Pronto. Espero que esteja muito alto. Next to him is Ipei. Ok, um servant. Até daí dá tu. Alright. Alright. Ok. Hi, Ipei. Hi, Shinojo. What are you guys doing here? Oh, it's you. Thanks so much for your help last night. Let's do some. Let's do some part of the camisa to clan. When I ran into him. Is he doing something cozy there? You know these two as well. Hmm. Yes, they helped me and Master Kamiji out a great deal last time. I've never had the chance to say thank you properly. Okay. What about you? How do you know them? Also a chance encounter. Our Lady had them join us as additional guards for a goods escort in order to sneak out of Rito undetected. So we all know each other, huh? Ah, uh, not exactly. We've only just met. We both came here to order some clothes and got to chatting. Somehow we ended up on the topic of Master Kamaji and Lady Haragi's relationship. Wait, it's okay to talk about that, right? <sighs> it's probably fine. They've known about it for a long time already. Oh, yeah! Paimon remembers those two had a thing. In fact, that was why Chisato wanted us to deliver a letter. That's old news, though. So why is it come up now? I was completely sincere. No, I don't remember who sent it. I think I'm supposed to have seen it on the mission of the ball launch, but who knows? Maybe it's the mission of the Ayat. The Ayat, I mean. Of course, this is just personal speculation. They haven't announced anything, and we wouldn't dare to ask. All right, keep going. I was instructed to place an order for some formal wear for a big banquet. Turns out that Ipe received the exact same instructions as I did. Okay, I'm They're okay. both preparing for a banquet at the same time. They're both purchasing the kind of fine wine and confectionery normally reserved for big festivals. It's hard not to put two and two together. Uh, Lady Hiragi has been in high spirits recently, and I heard she's on a diet as well. Surely it's all for the wedding. Lady Hiragi. Okay, Lady Hiragi. What's wrong? Oh, don't mind me. She's about to be happily married to the love of her life. I genuinely couldn't be happier for her. Right? I think so too. Yes, but we shouldn't let ourselves get overexcited. What if it's all a big misunderstanding? As things stand, we have no actual proof of a wedding. Now, if they sent me out to deliver wedding invitations, that would be a different story. Shinoju doesn't look like he's taking this very well at all. Sorry, I just haven't slept well recently. I'm right. ashamed to be so out of sorts at work. I'm not living up to my responsibilities, either to the Kanjo Commission or to my lady. Yep, Are you Kanjo. worried about their wedding? Not exactly. It's just everything feels kind of up in the air until they make it official. I get what you mean. I really do. We need this wedding to be set in stone before the celebrations can really begin. What should we do? Should we just straight up ask them? I don't know. That seems a bit rude. Right. If Ayaka knows about it, that means it's a sure thing. I, 
I don't think it's a good idea to bother the Yashiro Commission about this. Ah, uh, it's fine. She and Ayaka are practically best buds. There's nothing to worry about. I see. Then, thank you. Thank you very much. Having a definite answer will stop my thoughts from running wild. Let's hope. Let's go to the Kamisato Estate. Kamisato Estate. The Firmin Leaf Falls. Aqui temos que ir. Mano, eu vou ser sincero, não sei quem é a Lady Rogi. Deixa eu ver. Ok, o pessoal quer aqui perto. É a Kamisato Estate, eles disseram. Uff. As dele como a gente já acabaram. Lady Iragi. Onde é que eu me lembro de ter ouvido esse nome? Tô a ver como vai dar um. Quando eu a vir, eu acho que vou ficar do género. Ah, ok, é esta. Alright. Eu tenho feito isso antes, my bad. Eu literalmente comecei esta quest depois de ter acabado as comissões. This place impresses me every time I come here. It's so magnificent, but still so elegant. True. We'll just wait here. We don't want to cause any extra trouble for you. I like it wouldn't mind. Honestly, even if we did come with you, we wouldn't know what to say or do once we were inside. <laughs> so we'll just leave you to it. É, eu literalmente ando por aqui como, eu, como se fosse dono do lugar. <risos> Damn. The currency. Without looking at the board, you've ruined my strategy in one move. Amazing. <laughs> okay, mm. Now what should I do next? Ayaka, Toma, it's us! <sighs> <laughs> hey guys, it's been a while. If you're looking for my lady, I'm afraid she's not here right now. Oh? Huh? That voice. Toma, would that happen to be the traveler? Uh, yes. I am. <laughs> Greetings, traveler. Ayaka speaks of you constantly. Finally, today is the day. Damn. I am head of the Kamisato clan and Yashiro commissioner. Kamisato Ayato. Damn, ele, ele realmente comanda respeito. Ele lembra-me da introdução do Zongli. O que o Zongli é em, em Liwa, o Ayato é em Nazam. <laughs> no nível de status e respeito. I have long been indebted to you on my sister's behalf. Finally. I have the chance to express my profoundest gratitude to you in person. Ayaka is out today. If you are here regarding anything related to the Kamisato clan, you are quite welcome to discuss it with me instead. Okay. Oh, I... Uh, hi! Your flattering words... Flattering flatter words flatter us, us damn. Um, please excuse the suddenness of our visit, for <laughs> it is most improper etiquette. <laughs> Why on earth are you talking like that? Because well, this he form. seems like a pretty powerful person. He's already working his way up Paimon's list of people to never mess with. I am. Look, as soon as he stands up, the whole atmosphere in the room changes, and it feels like you gotta be super polite. I mean, it's a verdad. <laughs> you shower me with praise undeserved, my little guest. Praise undeserved. There is no need to be quite so formal. This is a private residence, so please. Relax. Oh, good. Cause that whole spiel was really tiring just now. All right, now that that's over, Paimon's just gonna ask the question. <laughs> we heard a rumor that Kujo Kamaji and Hiragi Chisato are gonna get married soon. Do you know anything about that? Kujo Kamaji, okay, do Kujo clan, Hiragi Chisato Chisato clan. Wait, what? Now do Hiragi clan. I just saw Hiragi a lot. Hiragi lady. Oh. I wouldn't have thought you'd heard about that yet. I see. Well, it's true. It wasn't long ago that I received the news myself. Damn. The head clans of two commissions are to become joined through marriage. This is big news for the whole of Inazuma. 
Since the Yashiro Commission presides over cultural and ceremonial affairs, it closely involves us, too. Yes. And since the commissions are kind of the face of the Almighty Shogun to the masses, this wedding is one that we have to treat as a serious affair. É um casamento right. político. Makes hmm. sense. Ah, oh, two true lovers becoming husband and wife. What a happy occasion. Será? It is. High-profile matrimonial links between two commissions are extremely rare. But these two truly love each other. Tradition should give way to freedom in this case. All right then. I'll be sure to pay them a visit to send the best wishes of the Kamisato clan. Hmm. No need. Ah, I'll visit them ver. personally this time. Mandar um ser vai ter ponto assim. But you have other things to be doing. This Damn. is a marriage between the Kujo clan and the Hiragi clan. The Kamisato clan must demonstrate an appropriate level is of that? respect. <laughs> the work of the Yashiro Commission is indeed multifarious. Normally, weddings and other ceremonies would come under the supervision of my sister. Oosh. But she is presently occupied with other matters. And I happen to have a little time to spare. This will be a good chance for me to pay a visit to the bride and groom. Oh, and would you two care to join me? Yeah, I let's go. You two have a special connection with the individuals in question. No, no, we would not be you. quite so interested much. in this matter. This Shabby being the case, why not come and offer your best wishes too? Uh, or is my presumption incorrect? Sinceramente, queria reconhecer oh, que mais pessoalmente do que os prontos. Não conexões aqui, super ordinárias ones, na verdade. Nós apenas acordamos para ajudar a entregar uma letra esta vez, é tudo. Mas, espera, isso significa que nós ajudamos a fazer esta festa acontecer? Tudo bem, então. Não posso te agradecer o suficiente. Your mere presence shall surely mean we are spared the futile pursuit known as small talk. Wait, All right, let's go. You're the Yashiro commissioner, but you can't do small talk? <laughs> <laughs> small talk is a chore. Of course, there are some people in the world who quite enjoy doing chores, but I am not one of them. Toma, I'm heading out with my two guests now. I'll leave the residence in your capable hands. Okay. Not a problem. Take care, my lord. All right. New shots, old branches. Okay, now I'm just going to no time to lose. Jesus, cross got some play here dentro. Ok, vamos dar as boas e mais notícias. Yashiro Commissioner. Hmm. Who are these two? Boy, I tell you to approach that is. They're friends of ours. I know I'll do the introduction. All right. Ah, continuemos. E tem um só que hoje vemos. Tem um martão em PC que não lembrou nenhum deles. That's it then. So be it. Great. So our hunch was spot on. It is a little inappropriate for me to have shared news of this magnitude with you. So I would be much obliged if you could keep it in strict confidence until an official public announcement is made. É o mínimo pode fazer. Don't worry, sir. We we give you our word. We won't tell anyone about it. That puts my mind at ease. Now, on the topic. We'd like to pay a visit to the Kujo clan. Would you mind leading the way for us? <laughs> of course not. I'd be honored. I guess this is where I Goodbye then. Damn. Oh, cheer up, Shinojo. I'll try. Thank you. Damn. <sighs> Jesus, you could have no more in my god.
Ah, Kujo Kama. Ok, já lembro quem são. All right then. Please excuse me. I'll lead you to it from here. Este é o gajo que enfrentou a Baal no final daquela disputa entre clãs. E claro, ele foi completamente aniquilado, mas... But, já estou a lembrar de quem ele já. Ok, thanks, Ita. Uma luta entre Ayatik e Baal na história seria interessante. Eu agradeço que você tenha um tempo de visita para nós, comissionário. Senão, você poderia ser seguro que nós teríamos uma recepção mais extravagante. Eu não quero dizer que impõe, Sr. Kujo. In fact, I'm not here on official business at all. I heard the good news about yourself and Lady Hiragi. What a glorious marital alliance this shall be. Given the close ties between our clans, Hiragi. it seemed only right that I should come and offer the Kamisato clan's congratulations in person. Oh, I'm truly honored. I hope the news didn't come as too much of a surprise. Hey there! We came to congratulate you as well! Since the incident with the Takatsukasa clan, things in the Tenryo Commission have slowly started to stabilize. Ah, push, push, you Takatsukasa clan to do the betrayal, okay. I'm still acclimating to the position of acting head of the clan. I just hope I'm up to the task, so I can live up to everyone's expectations. All right. You're far too modest. The public thinks very highly of you. They say you're hardworking, upright, and responsible. I respect, man. We're living through the balls. We're just being compatible. I wouldn't have achieved anything without the support of my people. But. Thanks to them, everything is gradually stabilizing, and I finally had the chance to focus a little on my personal life. Okay. <laughs> well, you're certainly making big progress in that department. <laughs> come on now, you're embarrassing me. All right, uh, moving on. Pardon me, I. It's perfectly all right. Please continue. I'm quite content to listen. All right. It's a joyous occasion. Lighthearted is exactly how things should be. Really, who stays stony-faced when talking about a wedding? <laughs> You're right. But I am curious to know, what's your honest opinion on the whole thing? Do you think it's too sudden? I am a lovely opinion to Ayat. Where there is true love, nothing <laughs> should be allowed to stand in its way. No doubt people will offer you a uh, colorful variety of opinions. <laughs> but of course... You will have factored this into your decision, and I'm sure you are prepared for whatever challenges may lie ahead. Indeed I am. So, please be confident. When your mind is made up, you ought not be worried about things for which you are already well prepared. Nevertheless, there is just one small aspect oh? of this that puzzles me a little. Please, but it is, my dude. You've been working hard to bring the Tenryo Commission in line. This is positive, and no doubt the beginning of important change. But on the other side of this equation, Lady Hiragi's father, Hiragi Shinsuke, is still in prison. Mm. If you choose now, of all moments, to announce a marriage between the Hiragi and Kujo clans, the kinds of rumors that may begin to spread both among the general public and in the Kanjo Commission are not likely to be in either of your best interests. Yeah. Couldn't have put it better myself, Sir Kamisato. This has been my biggest concern for quite a while now. Hiragi Shinsuke is firmly against me having any contact at all with Chisato. In the past, we've always had to communicate in secret by sending letters. I am so although now may not look like the best timing for this marriage, it may well be the only opportunity we have. Okay. Oh, that guy? Yeah, he acts like this sweet old man, but he was <laughs> determined to make as much trouble for us as possible. Oh, yeah, the legend slammed upon my place. I can see where you're coming from, but you're only pushing the problem, not solving it. You will still have to face it sooner or later. <sighs> yes, I'm well aware of that. But since Chisato had the courage to ask me to marry her in spite of everything, how can I disappoint her? Oh damn! Unexpected. Well, sort of. She raised the idea in a letter, and after some initial hesitation, I went to meet her and have a serious conversation about our future. It's funny, actually, because when I formally proposed to her in person, she denied having ever written that letter. <sighs> so coy. Damn. Huh? Really? Uh... Hmm. She didn't say. She just acted confused by the whole thing. She really committed to it. I'll never forget the look on her face. Damn, that's Celis. Oh, 
Yeah, no, I, I uh... Anyway, as her boyfriend, I knew she was just pretending. So I played along and said, ah, I was only joking about the letter. And then I proposed. After making some disgruntled noises about me making a stupid joke, she blushed and said yes. We spent that afternoon working through all the details of the wedding. Okay. So you discussed it and decided on a date? We did. I guess it was a chance to finally express our commitment to one another, clearly and completely. Huh. And you know what? I think it was about time. No Jesus. matter what happens next, I will always be there for her as the one person she can always rely on. Oh, give me a break. Sorry, but Bybat's been wanting to say this the whole time. Is it just this dude, or does everyone in love act like this? He just won't stop talking. I am. Apologies, my friends, and also to Sir Kamisato. I must sound like a fool. I mean, you perceive a lot of them as if they're boys. On the contrary, seeing you so positively smitten puts my mind at rest. No sure evidence could be of your true feelings and your commitment. A card, a card. If I had any reservations before, I certainly don't now. I wish you a joyous wedding when the day comes. Yeah, even if it's kind of irritating to see you all smug like this, <laughs> it's still a happy occasion. Good luck on the day and have a happy wedding. Thank you, Ah. It means a lot. We have some other business to attend to now. Until next time. Very well. <sighs> I'll see you. Know. All right. You part the ways with me. Okay, nice. In the bank, I'm going to show you how to do it. This is the story of my Julie. It's interesting. But yeah. He seems busy. That must be true for anyone about to get married, right? It's a happy kind of busy, though. Okay, I'm going to call them to sing the show. Kujo Kamiji is on cloud nine. What do you think, traveler? I am. Is it cloud nine? Is this? I'll touch for some kind of range. Ah, Cloud9. What are you thinking? He chalked it up to her being coy, but that doesn't sound like the Hiragi Chisato I know. I don't remember that, but I suppose it's bad, but see. But unfortunately, attempting to seek the truth of the matter would likely be fruitless. Yeah, how come? Whenever we come across stuff like this on our adventures, we always find a way to get to the bottom of it. A gente acompanha a Ayat, isso é o que interessa. I see. Cientista não vai ser interessante. So that's how adventurers think. In my opinion, we face two obstacles in this case. Firstly, we have very little information to go on, and I must be cautious about taking a stance. This makes it difficult to investigate. Agora perguntamos a Bright. Secondly, and more importantly, the person involved doesn't seem to care. If we intervene without his blessing, Good intentions may lead to catastrophic results. Okay. You do have a point. Kamiji doesn't seem worried at all. Everything in the world is intertwined. What looks like a simple outcome is often the result of multiple conflating reasons. Damn. Seeking the full truth would be a long and laborious process. It would be inefficient. Sort of. I have to take this approach, or the work of the Yashiro Commissioner would never be done. My opinion is something like this. When something strange happens, instead of trying to find out what could have caused it, it is better to look at the situation itself. Okay, if the outcome is positive, and no one was deceived or harmed in the process, then it is acceptable. If the outcome is positive, and no one was deceived or harmed in the process, then it's acceptable. Hmm. We don't know yet. After all, we don't know what Hiragi Chisato's thoughts are, do Is that we? I have to say, I'm impressed by your ability to zero in on the issue from such a short meeting. Most insightful of you. You are thorough and thoughtful, just as my sister describes. Huh? I should do it. But Chisato and Kamiji have already talked everything through, haven't they? I gotta fault that part that she said. Only if we are to take Kujo Kamiji at his word. But there are two sides to every story. I wish to know Hiragi Chisato's angle on this. Is that? Uh, makes sense. Don't worry right, about I it. I want chill. I was planning to visit the Hiragi clan to deliver my best wishes anyway. Let's take the opportunity to hear her thoughts. Diamond. If she's as committed as Kujo Kamaji, 
Perhaps they can navigate the challenges ahead successfully. But if not... Okay. Well, life isn't always a smooth journey. True. O que eu acho interessante nesta história toda é que o Aya estava a falar como se não quisesse falar com ela, mas íamos falar com ela de qualquer forma, portanto esta parte toda foi meio que desnecessário. Onde é que será mais? Acho que vamos aqui mais rápido. Era melhor apenas termos ido falar com a Xato, ou termos apenas uma pequena conversa nesta parte. Não, mas pronto.